Hey, what's up, guys? This is Joe Young, back for part three. Finally able to put everything together. For the most part, there's still just a couple of things I need to do to make it a little bit better. But I was able to put the figures into the cabinets and kind of see the idea of how it's going to turn out. If you guys are interested in doing something similar, I'll probably post a, a list of all the items you'll need to get or whatever in the uh, estimated cost. But, anyways. This is going to be my DBZ section. Um, we have the Dragon Balls with the two dragons there. A couple of the figures there. There's Goku, Piccolo, Trunks. And then this one, I didn't really have a theme yet, so I just kind of kept it all the same here. So that's Lightning right there, all by herself. A Bahamut, random tape. I still need to use that, actually, to hide the, uh, the wires on top and just tape it up there nicely, but haven't gotten around to that. Kill a kill. Got some smash amiibos. Chilling in there for now. Morgan down here in the bottom. And in the middle here is just going to be like kind of a book, and then I kind of have a couple uh, pop toys, so I just kind of did it in every other. And I had my other books in the, on the other shelves. Got Bleach up here. Ichigo, Rukia. Yeah, Kazumi from uh, what is it? They're alive, and then we got the Guyver classic. We got the Green Ranger, looking crazy. Um, Samus, and then we got Spike here from Cowboy Bebop. And this side is going to be um, the Street Fighter side, I guess. Got Chung Lee Ryu, and then we got Batman down here. So, uh, everything's look like it's coming together. I mean, obviously, I still have a lot of space for other ones. Um, and probably, oh, and then, then the Dragon Zord. No, it's not the Dragon Zord. Uh, it's the White Tiger Zord in his mega crazy form up there. And the wires, I still haven't played with it enough where I uh, can kind of hide it. I have the switch up here somewhere. Um, and I'll probably have to kind of mount it down so it can be easily put. But anyways, here are the doors, by the way. Very, pretty, pretty easily put in place, but very nice, actually. The only one drawback is it came with a gap like this, which is all right, I guess. It's not, you know, a killer or whatever, but it's not too looking too bad. But anyways, thank you guys, and uh, stay tuned for more. Peace.